So the first book is Busea, and it's a book about sea life. And what I like about it is that it's good for interpretive tasks, as it either you um, you can either introduce it um, fully as a story or in sections if that's um, a thematic unit that you're working on. The second book is Querido Primo, and is the story of two cousins, um, one that lives in Mexico, the other one that lives in the United States, and it provides a good model for interpersonal speaking and interpersonal writing because it gives us um, some questions that you can ask about different activities, hobbies, and the life in the different cities. The third one is I Love Saturdays y Domingos, and it's by Alma Flor Ada, one of my favorite um, writers for children's books. And it's a really cute story. Um, it, it not only touches upon the um, relationships among family members, relationships with grandparents, but um, it has the diversity component, which is pretty cool. This one, Radiant Child, is the life of young artist Jean-Michel Basquiat um, living in New York City, and um, his mom was Puerto Rican, and how that influenced um, his life, and it's pretty interesting um, to have in your library. And finally, Bravo, poems about amazing Hispanics that are written in first person as if the um, famous Hispanic is telling the story, but it's um, it's done in a poetic way. Really, really nice. So these are the books for this week. And I'll see you next week.